New at 6, tomorrow night, Clovis West of Buchanan High School will battle it out on the football field, but the two rivals have decided to come together to help the families of two late educators. CBS 47's Connie Tran is live in the control room with more on how the schools are working together. Connie. Catherine Ken, in the last three weeks, both Clovis West and Buchanan High Schools have lost two beloved teachers, Gavin Gladding of Clovis West and Ed Folsom of Buchanan High Schools. Tomorrow night, the two schools are going head to head on the football field, but they've decided to come together to, hope to help both of the families. When the Golden Eagles and the Bears square off, it's always a big matchup. But on Friday, the two schools are putting their rivalry aside for these two men. And our Clovis West administrative team, who again has connectivity over into the Buchanan area as well, knew and loved Mr. Folsom um, as well as Mr. Gladding, and looked at this with the community for the families. Kelly Avans is the spokesperson for Clovis Unified. Tomorrow night, uh, every entrance to the football game will have donation. All the proceeds collected will be split evenly and given to the families of Gavin Gladding and Ed Folsom. Even in the sadness of losing him as a person, it was great to see the community come together to support such a good human being and also to support his family. Our hearts are hurting today and we're really thinking of the Folsom family and hoping that we can do anything to support them. Avant says the unity between the two schools is indicative of the family bond all Clovis Unified schools have with each other. We love our competition, we love our rivalry, rivalries, we get behind them, We've, we're friendly competition all the way, but we also are again that bigger family. And Ken Catherine, it's no doubt the players will be playing with heavy hearts tomorrow. The game is, again, Clovis West's homecoming game, and that's taking place at Veterans Memorial Stadium at Buchanan High School. Live tonight in the control room, Connie Tran, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.